Welcome back to Ozark's Fox Sam. It is time to guess which celebrities have turned another year older. Oh, right, then. In this edition of Celebrity Birthdays. Yeah, absolutely. Oh, I thought it should be fancy. <laughs> All right. Well, you're very fancy with your I'm brooch wearing there. your grandmother's brooch. My grandmother's brooch. Yes, it looks great on you. It's a nice oh. little pop of color. I pop. I like it. I, I like wish it. they make men's brooches like this. Well, why can't they? I Just don't start know. a trend, okay? Oh, well, let's do it. Start a trend. All right. Yeah. I am going to. I'm going to start with a new uh, name for me I'd not heard. That I, I mispronounced it during the commercial break, and Kelly corrected me. It is Bela Fleck. <laughs> right, and he said it was a girl. He and I thought it was Bella. Bella. But that's okay. Who's a legendary award-winning banjo player. Yes, he is. Uh, and yeah. You obviously know who this person is, so. Well, yes, um, I'm, I'm going to guess. I don't know for sure. I'm going to guess he's probably 51. 52. I may be all wrong. Oh, see, he's a lot older than we thought. Okay, then. Okay. All right, let's go Bella. on to Adrian Grenier, who is from Entourage, The Devil Wears Prada, okay. Drive Me Crazy. Uh, I, I'm not a big fan of his. He's got big lips and I cannot lie. <laughs> yes, he does. I did like him in uh, Entourage. I did watch um, Entourage, and I didn't care for his character. You but know, he was, me. I did see him in The Devil Wears Prada. I thought he was He was in Hathaway's yeah. boyfriend. Yeah, yeah. he was. Uh, I don't know, what, 36? Oh, I don't know, Jared. 37. 42. Oh! oh! Wow, okay. Kaylee, you can't guess or you're not going to have a mic on. That's right. She's, she's close. Gonna... She's closer than we have been. All right. Uh, how about uh, Arlo Guthrie, singer and a songwriter? How are you? I know this song. I know the song. Sid, don't you know me? I'm a native son. Um, he, he's probably 72. Oh! Well, there you go, Arlo. Arlo. Happy birthday okay. to you. All right. Uh, now we're going to go to Phyllis Smith from The Office. And I love her. Story about Phyllis. Okay. Guess what? What? Starting with The Office, she was one of their casting directors. She was. And she was working on casting the show, and they needed somebody to fill in and kind of just be an extra character. They didn't find anybody. They just fill a sit in. Ended up becoming a character on The Office. And her real name is Phyllis, and she played Phyllis on the show. And did you love it? Did you love her character? I love her. Okay. Talk about, you think you're a casting agent, now you're an actress. Now you're an actress. It just happens that quickly. Yes. Okay. Um, oh you would know gosh. better than I would, Jeremy. That, I mean, I really, I, it's got to be, I, I don't want to go too old, but I'm going to, what, 59, 60? Really? I don't know. I'm going to say 63. 68. Oh, okay. Okay. Phyllis. Yeah. Okay. Looking good, Phyllis, honestly. Oh, I love this next person, Miss Erica Jane. Oh. Erica Girardi is her married name. She is a singer, actress, star of The Real Housewives of Beverly Hills. Of Beverly Hills. She is fierce with a capital fierce. Okay. She got those pumped up lips right there. Her stage name, she's married, yeah. Kelly, just so you know. Okay. She's married to the real life lawyer from Aaron Brockovich, who Julia Roberts oh, worked with. Oh, is that with. right? Mr. Mazury was his oh, name in the movie. Yes. Yeah. The older guy. She's married to the real life version of him. Oh, wow, that was a great story. And they got some money. They got some money. She has a chapel in her house. Are you serious? Her very own personal chapel where she goes to pray. Oh, oh my goodness. Well, we all need a private little space, but she, I don't And have I'm a telling you, yeah. she is fierce on stage, okay. and she is a character, and she is like, and if you have a fight with her, at the end of it, she goes, you know what? We're good. Oh, we're good. are you serious? We're good. Where's, uh, what's her, does she have an accent or something? No, she's like, we're good. Okay. There yeah, go. I love Erica I'm Jane. I'm not sure I know what that means, but how old is she? Uh, 49? Okay, 48. Oh! oh you, <laughs> they're playing the song, It's Expensive to Be Me. That's one of her songs, oh, and oh. it is expensive to be her. Wow. She oh, takes yeah. with her everywhere she goes, like a five-person glam squad who does her hair, makeup, costumes, everything, anywhere she goes. I don't want that. I want to do my own. Don't get me Good started thing, on I don't this have Erica right, okay. Jane. I oh, love her. Who else we got? Okay. Oh, Jessica. Yeah. Jason. What? Uh, Jessica's probably 38. What do you think? 40. Okay. Wait, no, no, she's... Oh, oh you should have priced this right at me. I was going to because then I was thinking about Christina Aguilera. I was just looking at Britney Spears' age yeah. and I should have... Oh. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, I'm going okay. to say this next actress, the way she would say it, Sofia Vergara. All right. Because oh. Sofia Vergara is so that beautiful. Is, yeah. Yes, she is. She's so gorgeous. And I'm telling you, she's one of the ladies, I've seen pictures of her younger. Uh -huh. She gets better looking with age. As you know how they say older? men usually get better looking with age? She gets better looking every single year, in my opinion. Oh, that's good. Good for her. I think that's she looks fantastic. amazing. I didn't care for the young pictures of her. Oh, really? She is stunning. And now, how old is she, Jeremy? I'm trying to think if she'd be older or younger than Erica Jane. 
Um, I'm, I'm going to guess. You guess. Okay, she said Kaylee 40. says 46. I say 42. Oh, I was going to say 49. Oh, really? But it maybe I'm telling you. Oh, okay, well, we right were, in there. Right we in were there. in Zibola okay. Park. Oh, in Zibola Park. Well, happy birthday, Sophia. And she's married to that one guy from, um, oh, my gosh, I can't think of his name. But anyway, he anyway. was on uh, True Blood, I think, or some one of those shows, which he's a really nice guy. Yeah, awesome. Yeah. I used to watch all, or look at all the tabloids. I knew who was married to who, who was divorced, who was coming up with this and that. But I don't have time to look at those You don't anymore. read the tabloids I don't read at the, tabloids the anymore. checkout stand anymore? Well, if I have a little bit of time, but okay. not, not as much. Yeah. Um, by the way, you know, we still have our Chateau on the Lake giveaway going on right oh, now. Right. Go to ozarksfirst.com slash contests to enter. You'll hit the contest. You'll see the Chateau. Hit that, and you'll enter your information. We give away a winner every month yeah. for a free night at the Chateau on the Lake. Please enter now, and it could be you, oh, the yeah, winner. I would love it. It's yes. a great prize to have. All right, we want to thank our guest, Springfield Little Theater, Tammy Jenkins, and, of course, all of you for watching us today. Yes, do we want to uh, have you make a man's brooch? I think that could be a project This could be one of my DIY time projects. This is what we should do, Jeremy. I think I would actually like, because I think it's a good accessory. A little less bling for the boys. All right, thanks for tuning in. <laughs> to Ozark's Fox AM. Have a great day, everyone. See you in the morning.